Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Chase at Rocky Mountain ATVMC and today we are showing you the Edge Goggle from Klein. All right, everyone, thank you for checking in. So today we are showing you the Edge Goggle from Klein. Now the Edge is kind of one of those goggles I call a hidden gem in the goggle world because I don't think many people, when they think of Climb, associate them with your high-end premium goggles, but that is what you're getting with the Edge. There's two options available. You have the off-road version coming in about a buck 40, then you have the snow version right around 170. So we are making an investment here, but there are some features about this goggle that I really, really like. There's a couple things you definitely want to know that I feel like we're kind of a miss on Climb's part, but overall, it's a rock solid goggle. You've got their slide lock lens changing system with the magnets, which I think after seeing it and using it is the best lens changing system that is on the market, optically correct lens, and some other great features. So we're gonna go through, we're gonna talk about all those. Before we do that though, let's cover fitment. Now you'll hear them call this a frameless goggle, but there is a frame and the reason that they use that name is because the lens actually goes completely on the outside of the frame so it doesn't click into the frame like a lot of goggles do so that's why they call it frameless but you look at it it's a nice big goggle in fact i just love the look of this goggle i think they crush it in that category and the fit is good it's nice and wide you get a lot of you got a lot of field of vision good peripheral vision the only thing i noticed and i had some other riders try these on to confirm what i was feeling is that i feel like the face foam right around my nose is going to pinch it a little bit now i'd have to go ride in these to confirm that but that was something that I did notice just trying these on. But keep in mind, that is why we have our fit guarantee. If you get these goggles, you can try them on, try them on with your helmet on. If you don't like how they fit, send them back in brand new unused condition and we'll give you free shipping both ways for a different goggle just to make sure you get the goggle that is gonna be best for you. Now looking at these, I already talked about how I like the looks. You've got a 50 millimeter strap on here. You've got silicone on the back to keep that in place. Triple layer face foam, which is very comfortable when you have these on. So triple layer just means it's gonna do a great job when it comes to sweat management. And another thing that I like about the edge is you've got a lot of good venting on here. So you've got venting in the foam, obviously all around the top and the bottom, but you even have some foam here on the sides to get some airflow coming in there. And then also on the actual lens, you can see that you've got these three cutouts up here on top to help get some airflow going directly into the goggle. And there is an anti-fog layer on the inside of the lens as well. So they've done everything they can to get good airflow and help combat fogging with that. Now the nose guard on here is removable. So this is another cool kind of unique feature of this is that you've got a magnet right here in the center and then just two small little clips on each side, but very easy. So you can just pop that down. It'll actually just pop back into place. But if you don't want to run the nose guard, very easy to remove that and then put it back on if you do want to. Let's talk about the lens here. These are the big features and what makes this unique. So again, injection molded lens, optically correct. They call it their HD lens. But what I love about this thing is a lens changing system. I don't know about you, but personally, I'm the type of rider where I will swap out lenses in the middle of the day. If it's cloudy in the morning, I want a lens that isn't gonna be too dark, so I might run a clear lens. But then later in the afternoon, if it starts to get sunny, I'll put a tinted lens, lens inside there, just kind of go along with what the weather is doing. So for me, it's important that it's easy to take a lens out and put it back in without you know getting it all smudged up and just being quick and easy. So what they are utilizing with this is their slide lock system with the magnets. I will show you how quick and easy it is to take this lens out and it's just as easy to put it back in. Right here on the left side of the goggle, you have this little tab. All you're gonna do is slide that up and as soon as you do that, it allows this thing come off. It is that easy to remove this lens. Very simple to do. And you can see if you look at the inside here, you can see this frame, you're going to have the magnets that are sitting inside here. And then to put it back on, you're just going to reverse the process. Very simple to do. You have this little tab right here. You're just going to slide that in, drop it into place. It'll almost just kind of click into place with the magnets. And then you're just going to move that little tab back down. You're ready to go. So I'll do it right now. There it is, literally what, two seconds, maybe. I love it. Best lens changing system I think that is out there. So props to climb for that. You got outriggers on here, outriggers to help give a better fit when you have the goggle inside the helmet. So the strap is actually pulling on the outrigger versus the frame of the goggle. So it keeps a good tight seal around the rider's face. Here's the one drawback and we got to talk about it. We're talking about tear offs. There are no tear off posts 
on this goggle. You don't have them on the lens, there's no tear off post on the actual outrigger, and it doesn't matter which lens you go with, they just don't have it. And for me, I'm, it's a head scratcher. I don't know why you'd make an off-road goggle that doesn't have tear off posts. So I called Klein because I wanted an answer and what I got from them was they didn't want to have tear off posts on there because they felt it could obstruct the rider's field of view a little bit. But personally, I think that having mud on your goggle is going to be a lot more obstructive than having tear off posts. So that to me is a big miss on this goggle, but Klein did say that they plan to in the future either sell a lens that have tear off posts or just have a lens that will have the tear off posts included with this goggle but they didn't give me a win. So that is a definite thing about this goggle that you wanna know before pulling the trigger. If you wanna run tear offs, you're not going to be able to do that with this. But aside from that, everything else is rock solid. Like I said, you've got a big field of vision, you've got that injection molded lens, that quick release system is awesome. Again, this is the NX version. Now with the snow version, here's the differences. The snow version, you get all the bells and whistles we just talked about. The difference though is with the lens, you have a dual pane lens with a three millimeter gasket that separates those two. If you're separating the warm air from the cold, that's gonna really help combat fogging. And also, when you look at the top of the goggle, the foam up here on top is gonna be a lot taller. So you're just getting more foam on top, that's just gonna create a better seal, help keep a lot of that cold air out. So again, and with the snow version, don't just think it's just snowmobilers and snow bikers that would want these. Maybe if you do ride in a lot of cold weather, you're doing slower technical riding and you don't want to worry about fogging, then the snow version could be a good option for you. If you have questions or comments about the Edge Goggle, we would love to get those answered, so make sure to leave those below in the comments section. To grab these goggles and to see all the other great goggles that Climb does offer, like say the Oculus or the Viper Pro, click on the link I head over to RockyMountATVMC.com. As always, orders are 75 bucks ship free. If you like this product spotlight, you wanna see more like it, subscribe to the Rocky Mountain YouTube channel, hit the notification bell, and always stay up to date. I'm Chase, we'll see you on the trails.